Assalamualaikum, my name is Maria here. Welcome to the Asian Generation channel. You guys must be wondering right now, why I'm alone? Where is Rabia? Where is she? Okay, I have an announcement to make. F from now, from today, from this video, I'm gonna handle this channel alone without Rabia anymore. So let's start our reaction. Today, I'm going to react on a video. We found Pakistan in Malaysia. How come? Okay, or oh, is a mouth watering Pakistani food? And why PK and the channel is filled of visions? Let's watch it. Chale! So you guys probably know by now that me and Irfan were born in the UK. But we are Pakistani at heart. You could date the girl out of Pakistan, but you can't date Pakistan out of the girl. Being brought up in a Pakistani household and being on the road continuously, there comes to a point when you start missing some of the home comforts. And that is the craving of some authentic home-cooked Pakistani okay, delicious food. So during the course of our travels, Malaysia. when we've been traveling across Thailand, Vietnam and other Malaysia, countries, like, we've found many restaurants the serving days, the Indian cuisine. Uh, but the problem is, more. they're always catered so towards the Western tourists. Place. And they're nothing like the food that we eat at home. But we've found a place that's as close to as going to Islamabad, Lahore or Karachi here in Malaysia. Oh, so this is okay. actually located near the Chowki area Chowky. and you can actually see Who the in towers from a distance. <laughs> so come on guys, let's show you what this area is all about. Are you just uh, looking at your shop over Is there? One? Yeah, so I've basically Brown come to Kuala Lumpur delicious. specifically to check out how my two shops are doing. Looks like they're doing well. They've not opened that shop, so I'm going to be having a word with my staff. The little boy is so good. Just silent. Oh, this is famous. Pak Pum Jab. Did you even have like tables outside? Like, it's oh, as if you're sitting outside in Pakistan. The guy is literally setting up. It's a nice warm day. Oh. and. This is just like Pakistan, it brings back so many memories. There's so you know what, I've actually Pakistan just seen behind here, the guy over there was telling us you can get really different get masalas out. that you cook with. And behind here, I've just seen some pan which I used to eat also when I was in Pakistan. They're like small little packets and they're a nice little thing to have after you've had a heavy meal and it kind of freshens up your mouth. So I think I'm going to get a couple of them. Uh, Asalaamu As Alaikum. Uh, Urdu, what do you have? Uh, ding dong, yeah, Pakistan. Ding dong. Khan food. Told you. Okay, Khan food. Jo tulsi pan masala hai, wahan mil jayega. Let's go. Theek hai, okay. Everything there. Hi. Okay. Thank you. Zakala. Right. So looks like there's a shop over here which has got all the Pakistani things that we used to get when we were in Pakistan. I think last year I visited one. There's these guys coming up now. They sit like they're in Pakistan. They're proper Pakistan. You know what? That's how they sit as well. So let's see what they say. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Kya le theek ho? Alhamdulillah. We made it to Khan Superstore, which the guy oh. over there was telling us about, where you can get all your authentic Pakistani masalas. So let's go check it out. And right off the bat, I can see first things first, you've got all the Pakistani matai. And these are my favorite guys, who love German. I love and the you know what? game changer is if you have them with ice cream, vanilla ice cream. White color, like Keep it. No, well, this. Grandma used to put it on. When you're brown, you want to be white, and when you're white, you want to be brown. That there is in every single. Pakistani household that you can ne ever go to and if they don't have it, I'm sorry, you're not Pakistani. The funny thing is, as soon as I walk in here, have there's that, that distinct smell that you get you when you enter any oh Pakistani I was just going to say that. Right? And here guys, you have a selection of cake rusk. Cake rusk and biscuits. These are the oh, most like amazing biscuits shop, and right? cakes that I you can get. My favourite are these yes. ones. Dip it in tea, guys. I've just seen amongst all these biscuits, right, one that is really, really close to my heart. This one over here is just amazing. This is 
a Pakistani macaroon. And if oh. you know anything about French patisserie, it's macaroons are really expensive, really. but these ones wow. taste exactly wow. like a coconut macaroon and they're delicious. My dad, may Allah give him the highest place in Jannah, he came back from Pakistan once and he brought a massive box of them back and I swear within one hour they were all gone. We were little kids, wow. but I'm getting a few of them within just to bring that back that memory. I remember sitting down with him, having a cup of tea and it was just amazing. You got your chili powder here guys, you got your haldi, oh, you got chaat masala here. And it smells like proper Pakistan. Ajwan feed. If you know, you know, guys. I used to mum mum used to make me have these when I was pregnant, so it gives you strength after having a baby. Oh. They're like steroids. <laughs> and guys, I'm going to show you something really special now. This is Pakistan's national drink. It's beautiful. It's red. It's bright, and it's stink. So we have found our restaurant here, which is Ras Baloch, Pakistan. We also tested this out, we tried it out before and it's been confirmed that this is the closest we're going to get when it comes to Pakistani dishes. So we're going to take you guys along with us and we're going to show you this massive pan of oil that you get the most delicious scrumptious chipotle kebabs that you've probably never seen before. Come on, let's go. Wow. Ras Baloch, I think I went here. Last time. Hey guys, I'm so excited. We have everything here. I think I'm gonna go for a few curries, some biryani rice. They've even got veg dishes. Literally, take your pick, guys. It's like having a nasi kandar for Pakistani cuisine. That is what I'm talking about. That is home cooked pilau rice right there. I'm just gonna put a bit of curry. We've also got some horses here, but. I'm going to give a pass because I'm trying to be a bit healthy but they are really really nice Can't go wrong with a bit of salad And to top it off guys, you've got the green chutney which I'm going to put all over the salad This is minced meat guys This Pima is one, yeah, with meat. the peas on it So I've not got enough room on my plate so I'm just going to pop it Put it, it on there. the side and we'll have some roti yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that is what you call a plate of heaven guys yeah. All right, people, here is my plate of goodness right now, and I'm so excited because I know it's going to taste absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to go in with a bit of the uh, lamb, the lau. I am going to get me some of that mixed cucumber salad with that yogurt sauce I put in. Mix it all up with some curry, and here we go. Okay, that reminds me of my sister Nazi when she makes that for us on E day. That is so good. <laughs> wow, look at that. Alhamdulillah, that looks absolutely delicious. This was sizzling before on the plate, right? And if it's as good as what we had in Peshawar, you're about to find out. So, look at that crunch. Oh, it's new to MRT. Oh wow. my god, that tastes better than the one that we had in How do I know that chapti kebab is the best? Wow. That is so good and that is a heavy thing oh, guys. These chapti kebabs are awesome. Oh, it's good. <laughs> So I like having my food with a bit of tandoori roti which is a slightly thicker version of the chapati and it's made in the hot tandoori. My mouth is watering because I'm really hungry. I'm going to give this a try. Bismillah, let's find it. Well, it's not supposed to dip on any chutney. It should be like it's hungry. I'm so hungry but this is absolutely delicious. Well, it it's a big version of the Pakistani yeah, chapati kebab that we get on Eid when we're at home. This is absolutely delicious. So in continuation with the barbecue because I love my healthy grilled food I've got like a reshmi kebab here. This is basically a chicken cheese kebab. Let's go in with this. Mm. Very very gingery. That is delicious and you know what the good thing is it's flavorful and healthy too. And to wash it down guys, I got myself a Coca-Cola because that's how you do it in Pakistan, full fat as well. So we're going to enjoy the rest of this food because it is absolutely delicious <laughs> but yeah, you're gonna enjoy if you want to see us eating, here it is. Look at him, 
He's going for me. He's flipping it in his mouth. He's going full throttle with the yakhni rice. Oh, he looks it. What did you say, Evan? He's a proper Pakistani boy at heart. He is, and he's. He likes chapati, he likes roti, he likes salad, he likes oh, chawal. You know, like none of these spaghetti and all that kind of stuff. So that's the Korea's food reaction. I think it's a 10 out of 10 from him too. <laughs> <laughs> but we've been told that you have to let the kids get messy, have yep. to embrace it. You have to embrace it. Even though I'm dying inside. You can't finish a truly authentic Pakistani meal without having a cup of tea. Mm. And you know what guys, this is absolutely one of our favourite cups of teas all around the world. It's rich, it's creamy, it's sweet, it's just yeah, long time. so delicious. You have to try it. Cheers. Hi. Oh. And those. Oh. <laughs> it's time to go. So guys, we just finished up and guess how much it was? You're not gonna believe it. It was 52 ringgit. That is bagging book. Book it. I literally had a plate full of whatever I wanted. Erfan got a chicken shami kebab, we got jiffy kebab, we've got Zakaria some chicken pieces as well, which was non-spicy. I got a can of coke, two cups of teas, and a bottle of water. That is just amazing. So guys, I think I am going to knock out right now and uh, we're going to get this little guy home so this is bedtime. Yeah! <laughs> mm. Happy Tell everybody to subscribe. Subscribe if you want to see more of this face. Like the video, like the video, like the video. Like the video, follow your visions and do all that jam. Smash that like button, tap it so hard and we'll see you guys on the next one. <laughs> we'll see you in the next one. So happening. Okay, so how is the video? I like it. What about you? It's so happening in the video, the way they uh, talk, the way they edit the video, and the foods. Oh my god, mashallah. The food is, of course, it's Pakistani food, right? Who don't love Pakistani foods? <laughs> Even though, uh, yeah, my first, I love, of course, my own national dish, right? I love nasi lama, I love roti chanai. The second one, I love Pakistani food because I uh, eat that quite of a lot of time, actually. When I want to eat it, I want to, actually, it's a, uh, the nearby here is uh, in Setia Alam and then KL. Yep. I want to try actually I want I never try uh Hans before. I work I passed by Hans when it was um I think last year uh when I want to break the fast. So uh that time I went with Miss uh that time I went with Rabia. Mm, we went to Mm. Oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't remember the name. <laughs> but we passed by Hans restaurant and it was amazing. The smell, actually, the smell was amazing. So uh, I hope that next year, I think I'm going to try there. Have you went there? Hans restaurant in Chowkit, I think. Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> because my place is not in KL actually so I don't really remember where is the KL place so yeah thank you so much to those who recommend us this video actually me not us anymore <laughs> if you like this video please share this video to your family members and friends don't forget to share it to your social media as well please subscribe our channel Malaysian Girl Reactions and turn on notification button so you guys won't miss our latest video Please follow our social media account, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Malaysian Girl Reaction. See you guys at our next video. Bye. Assalamualaikum.